Hey guys, how's it going? Um, posted no video blog yesterday, and every time I don't post a video blog, I always make sure I tell you why. Um, yesterday was one of those days where I was trying to catch up to everything I had scheduled for myself, but I had kept failing at everything I was trying, so it wasn't working out. Um, I'm working on these shoes now. Uh, new technique, I'm going to describe it to you soon, but as you can see, I'm trying to put some black patent leather around the entire things. And uh, it's really difficult to use patent leather because of the fact that uh, it reflects everything. So as you're working on it, every imperfection is magnified by at least twice as much because it's shiny and it's showing straight at you. So um, I'm doing a few new things. You can see I've got fabric glued onto here. Um, this I had to pull up because of the fact that I have separated. I don't know if you can see it. You probably can't. The, uh, the midsole, I learned how to separate that because, for example, right here, I have, wow, that is, really needs some work to smooth that out. <laughs> but I, um, I had to tuck this down underneath the midsole. So uh, the theme of the shoes is Batman is the patent leather, Joker is the corduroy, and the Joker's taking over Gotham City. The tongues are going to be like this. And they're going to have a really badass painting from the 1990s animated cartoon. I'm also working on a few other pairs of shoes at the same time. But uh, these are the ones that uh, have my main focus right now because this is the, the first um, pair of shoes, the first client chronologically out of all the other clients. So um, I'm working on that. And I'm also waiting for uh, some, some shoes to come in from Brisk. Uh, some shoes that are going to be Darth Maul shoes which will be pretty fun, but I'm going to use a very similar technique here where I'm going to be putting black patent leather over a pair of, uh, actually, it's pretty sweet. I found a guy who made some custom Nike Dunks mixed with Nike Blazers. Um, and so they're already, like, covered in red suede, and they are, um, you know, customs already as it is. So we're going to see how, how it is when it, when it gets here. Um, I might have to end up not using them buying my own pair because these, these might be, like, so bootleg I can't use them. But uh, they might just be a pretty good pair of customs. The only problem is that I haven't heard of this custom shoe artist before, and I feel like if uh, he's any good, then I would know who he was. Or maybe he just isn't very good at marketing himself. So anyway, um, that's that. Uh, I still haven't seen The Hunger Games. I was going to go watch it today, but I've been too busy. Uh, my days off, I never have a day off, but the days that I give myself a little bit of free time now that I've been scheduling out my time are Saturday and Sunday. So I'll probably go see it this weekend. Plus, I have a friend who's... Um, on a uh, on a trip right now to Hawaii where he had to basically skydive out of an armada of helicopters after they had dropped a hundred thousand dollars off in a crate in Hawaii and he's with like a Muay, Muay Thai fighter I think that's how you say it this really badass chick and then I think it was a Navy SEAL but I think that guy well I can't say anything else I'm not gonna tell you what it's for or anything like that it's probably illegal what I've told you so far but uh, anyway, so I have a friend, uh, he's really into the Hunger Games, he's on this, um, he's in this competition right now, and uh, you know, we'll see where it goes from there. But anyway, um, I'm going to get back to this, uh, I'm having a hard time with it, but I'm trying to teach myself, and I guess I like challenges. So, um, oh yeah, and if you guys are in LA, uh, hit up Pancakes and Booze tonight, $5, um, free pancakes all night, bunch of dope art, well, hopefully dope art, we'll see how it goes. And then uh, beer for sale. All right. See you guys tomorrow.